honestly when i was coming in i thought it was going to be something very serious but the fact that it had elements which were so humorous but at the same time helped us reflect on so many issues that we face in the world today i think that really stood out for me the fact that it was done in a very clever way so i would say clever thoughtful and thought provoking and clever thought provoking and witty I thought they were, uh, they work really well together on stage, they're an engaging trio and I like the fact that even though it didn't have a clear uh, linear storyline, it was still very engaging and um, yeah, by the end I was a big fan of all the characters. So I was expecting a true crime podcast and this really pushed at the boundaries of what a true crime podcast could be. Um, Similarly, I had no idea what it was going to be. I liked the interactive bits. It was engaging. I thought they um, played their characters very well and they swapped clothes and stuff, so enjoyed it. I really loved the way the movement was completely inexplicable to begin with. And that over time, it really kind of, it, the light bulb came up. Oh, that's a dog. Oh, that's a man sniffing around. Oh, that's a, and I, li I loved the, the movement. I liked the, the seriousness of the movement. I love the surrealism. So I love the surrealism. Three words. Very thought provoking. I like how it's so interactive with the audience and the energy is amazing. Oh, in three words. I think um, I just found it really thought provoking, interesting, and just really topical. Like, really stuff that we should be thinking and talking about a lot these days. Yeah.